hormones are very important when it comes to breastfeeding. So the breasts are an important part of the breastfeeding and the brain is actually a very important part of the breastfeeding because it's in the brain where the hormones are made. It's also in the brain where we feel stress. So when, first moms, before you put the baby on, take a nice deep breath. This is a model kind of of how our breasts, I brought a breast anatomy. When the baby starts suckling, on the breast, it's going to tell your brain to release oxytocin. Oxytocin is um, the love hormone. It's the hormone that got you through labor and helped you to birth your baby. But when the oxytocin hits these little things here on the breast, these are called alveoli, it's going to squeeze the alveoli. And the alveoli are attached to these straws, but say they're tubes. And then as the baby's suckling, um, the milk's going to go from the alveoli through the straws tubes into the baby's mouth, which is very cool. Then it goes to your brain, and it goes to your alveoli, it goes out, and then it just, it's a, it's a cycle. So the other hormone that's very important and breastfeeding is called prolactin. Prolactin is the hormone that makes your milk. And so it makes the milk and it puts it in the alveoli. Uh, prolactin, especially in the first six weeks, is highest at night. So a, it is, very important that a mom breastfeed throughout the night. I'm not saying every hour, but every two to three hours throughout the night, because that's when the prolactin level is highest. When you work with high prolactin levels, that usually helps you to have a really good milk supply for that upcoming day. If you go two or three nights early on with the baby not nursing through the night, or maybe nursing once through the night, depending on the mom and baby, but more often than that, your milk supply is gonna come down. Um, I know um, some women, thought that they could exclusively pump during the day and have dad do all the feeding at night so she could sleep through the night, but that was detrimental to her milk supply.